Hey, this is my Halloween hexapod, or Halloween hex, I was calling it. It's a larger hexapod I purchased from eBay, off of eBay, and then the servos are from Hobby Keen. So it ended up not, not costing a whole lot, you know, a few hundred dollars in parts. And I just recently got these eyes kind of working, where they're mounted on servos, and so the servos tilt side to side as it walks and it blinks as you can see and the blinking rate is random and the uh, uh, both the duration between blinks and how long the blinks take to blink and every tenth no there's a ten percent chance that a blink will be a double blink and let's see let's come up a little bit closer here I'll tell you some more about it and there's a couple other eye patterns that it can display. Okay. And I'm using a propeller microcontroller. And the control board on there is a, a quick start board. And so uh, there's a lot of these around in uh, radio shafts on sale. But from Parallax, they're about $35, and I'm using one underneath the big black um, top surface there. And I have a couple big voltage regulators. And then there's, of course, there's 18 servos around the legs, and I have four servos controlling the eyes. And I'm using a wireless nunchuck to control it. And I think it's kind of working well. I like it so far. Um, Yeah, it's rotating now. I still need to kind of tuck away the switches and um, get the battery better situated. But this is just a progress report on how it's coming along. And I think it's kind of cool. And obviously I need to get that battery tucked away better. Um, and actually, I, I'd probably use a smaller battery than that one. That's a, a 5 amp hour battery. And I think about less than half that size would be fine. Um, okay, that's it for now.